my name is Alex Cecilia. I'm a graphic artist, and I'm going to show you how to draw hair in Photoshop. The best thing to do is to figure out where your person that you're drawing is, where their hair is going. And if, like, the, for example, my girl's motion is kind of like her hair would be going this way. So I'm going to start off by, I'm going to finish off her, well, her skull. I'm going to try to. And then I'm actually going to give her some roots as to like where her hair comes from. To successfully draw hair, you need to have you need to have the root of all of where the hair comes from. And I'm just gonna give her a really short, kind of choppy haircut. And if it helps, I do recommend looking up some hairstyles online because I have a preferred hairstyle that I like to give a lot of my illustrations. I really like um, anything, any hairstyle that has kind of short, uh, choppy sideways bangs. Um, and I tend to do that a lot with my characters. Um, but I do like to try and also experiment with other potential um, hairstyles. So once you've got the, the basic layout of your hair, you're gonna wanna start doing lines from the roots, like so, because that's gonna help define the direction of your hair. And I made the mistake of drawing on the same layer as my, my skull head outline. That's okay, we can fix that. It is kind of annoying, but it happens. Sometimes it can actually benefit, because then you'll realize, oh, maybe I didn't draw that part right. And when you're drawing hair, don't draw too many lines because as you can see what I've done here, now I've drawn too many and they're starting to look kind of scratchy. So like as in right here in this area, it's minimal. So the information is kind of, there's enough information to let you know that there's enough hair and that it's going a certain way. And that's all you need. My name is Alex and this is how you draw hair in Photoshop. Thank you.